Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a makeup haul. I went to Target, Marshalls, and Walmart yesterday to try and find a tote bag for when I start school. And I picked up all this stuff and didn't even find a bag. But it's okay because I picked up all this stuff. We're going to start with the stuff I got at Target because that's where I went first. I got this Shea Moisture Youth Infusing Eye Cream. It looks like this, and it's in this little jar, and it says on here, instantly illuminates and gives a brightened appearance to eyes with this natural, rich, hydrating eye cream. I haven't used this yet, but I'm going to use it tonight, and I'm really excited. I also like this because it's cruelty-free, and I love products that are cruelty-free. The next thing I picked up is the L'Oreal 24-Hour Infallible total coverage foundation I picked up the shade um, 302 creamy natural it is a little bit too light for my skin tone but I made it work it's fine um, I love the coverage this has is so amazing it's very moussey the consistency and I love that and it does, you can already see, it really does have beautiful coverage. It's the foundation I'm wearing on my face right now. The only thing I don't like about it is it caked up around my nose and around my mouth. I have a really dry mouth and nose. So I might just have to moisturize a little bit more when I use it. But other than that, the coverage is amazing. The color is a little off, but I made it work. So this is an A+. I like it. The next thing I got is this NYX Tea Tree Balance. This was in the clearance section, so I had to get it. I've been wanting to get it for so long, but it usually is 11 almost $12. And I thought for this little thing, I thought that was too much, so I just never got it. I always pick it up every time I go, and I'm like, mm, no thank you, I'll get that next time. It says um, on the back... It reduces the appearance of skin imperfections, smooths, renews, and leaves skin feeling fresh and pure. I use this as a primer underneath my foundation. It did kind of irritate my skin for like a second, but then it went away really quickly. Um, I didn't really notice that it covered up my imperfections like it said it did. I might have to use it a little bit more to see. I'm probably only going to use this in my skin root instead of my makeup routine it only comes with 0.68 fluid ounces it's not even one fluid ounce and for this to be almost $12 I think it's ridiculous but we'll see we'll see guys this I was so excited to get this is the pure castle bar soap I actually like bars better to clean my makeup brushes than soaps because I hate putting it on my hand and then rubbing out my hand because my hand gets really really crinkly and I hate that feeling so with this I can put it in a like container filled with water and just rub it on there and then just use my hand to squeeze out the excess soap and the excess water so I'm really excited to try this I can't wait to try it I actually just washed my makeup brushes of course with just my luck there the last thing I got is this little pencil cup, but I'm going to use this for when I film. I'm going to put all my makeup brushes that I use in here because usually I'd have to take one of the ones I already have and take out all my makeup brushes, put them on my desk, and then put the brushes I was going to use in here. And I think that's really inconvenient, and I was actually on the hunt for a makeup holder, and I saw this and I thought it was so cute, and I was like, oh my god, I'm getting it. So that's everything from Target, we're going to move on to Marshalls next. So the first thing I picked up are these Precision Beauty 2-pack silicone pore scrubbers. It's actually a funny story. I had these and I lost the purple one and I dropped the pink one in the toilet. I don't know how. I just remember dropping it in the toilet and I was just very upset because I do love these. These work really well to take all the excess makeup off you have on. I go in with this in my cleanser to really get in my pores. So I was really mad when I lost this one and destroyed this one. The next thing I got that I'm very excited to try is the All Natural Activated Charcoal Tooth and Gum Powder. I was really excited to try this because I have charcoal pills that I use for my charcoal mask, but I've always wanted to try to whiten my teeth with them, but I was always so scared because 
I didn't know if like I needed a certain type of charcoal. So I'm glad that I found this because this is for your teeth and nothing else. So I can't wait to try this. It says on the back, apply a small amount to a moistened toothbrush and a brush as usual. Do not swallow, avoid getting moisture in jar. So I'm actually gonna use this tonight and I can't wait. I got a lavender chamomile body mist. I love the way lavender smells. It's probably one of my favorite scents. So when I saw this, I, I had to I had to have it. I had to. It says on the front, refreshment and hydration in every single spritz. And then the directions just say generously mist after cleansing skin or anytime skin needs a boost of hydration. So I use this on top of the tea tree balance after I put it on my face. I kind of sprayed this on my face after and then I set my makeup with this. I don't recommend doing that because when I sprayed this on after my makeup it left spots all over my face and I had to take my beauty blender and like blend in the spots. So I don't recommend doing that. Even though it doesn't say that, I thought like, hey, it's just a mist. Then the last thing I got, a makeup brush cleaner. And it's like a spot cleaner because I use so many of my brushes and I use them. I don't use the same brushes. I always use different brushes. And it's so annoying to clean all my brushes at once. So to have this is so amazing. All you have to do is take the brush spray it and then take like a tissue or a clean towel and just wipe it like this just like this of course the only brush I take was clean but whatever and it actually leaves a really good smell when I was smelling it in Marshalls it kind of smelled like like chemicals to me but now that I'm I put it on my brush it does not smell like that at all see like this it just smells like pure like acetone to me but on the brush it does not smell like that at all and then it's already dry okay so that's all the stuff for marshalls and now we're gonna bounce to walmart walmart only got two things because that was my last stop and i was like girl stop spending your money the one thing i actually did need on this entire trip were these cotton rounds because this is what i use to take off my makeup so i already busted this open and took one out and it's in my bathroom already and the last thing I got, which I really, 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 really love, is the Yes to Coconut Cooling Lip Oil. I've always wanted to try this brand, but I never, I don't know, I just never picked anything up. And it leaves such a beautiful finish on the lips. It actually already rubbed off. I had to refilm because my first video I could not find on my computer on the SIM card, so I had to refilm it. But I'm actually just going to apply this. I love the way it feels on my lips it goes on like a lip gloss even though it's a, like an oil it says on here it smells like coconuts I really do like this I don't know about the, the, the cooling part that it says on here I don't my lips don't really feel um, cooling so I don't know about that but it does a great job of hydrating my lips I like this I like this a lot and my favorite thing to do is highlight like my cupid's bow and then like the bottom of my lip right here and then put this on and it just leaves like a beautiful glow on my lips it's like I don't even need lip gloss so this is everything I got I hope you guys liked the video I hope I helped you out in any way please let me know if you have any of the products that I have and if you like them or if you hate them and please don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video bye guys I don't what am I even saying I don't even know I don't even know but I did have I don't think it happy